All right, so the last thing I wanna show you in this tutorial is how to send out newsletter emails to your email subscribers. So maybe you have like a new blog post, maybe you have like a special discount going on and you just wanna let your audience know about that special information. So um, to create a one-time email, we just quickly close out of this right here. And then we go to the pen icon on the top left where it says create, click on email. And now we just choose the regular option right here. And let's name this campaign um, special discount because we're gonna create an, a promotional email about a special discount that we have going on. Click on begin. And here we have to decide on who we will send that email to. So you can click on edit recipients. And right now, the only audience I have is the Maddox Tutorials audience. So I choose this one. And then let's say I only wanna send that email to people who have a specific tag. Um, so let's say I wanna send it to people who are, um, who have this tag, free ebook website, because those people have signed up on my website and my discount is specifically for those people. So we can kind of um, segment your audience using tags, or you can also use uh, segments if you have created segments in your audience um, in your audience list. Then click save, and then from information um, we're going to leave it as it is. This is the default from information right here, and then the subject line. Let's click here. And again, I suggest you don't put something like discount or free or offer in your subject line because that will trigger the spam alert of a lot of email providers. So let's say something like um, we're doing so something crazy today and that should entice people to actually click on the email. And maybe preview text again. This is what you see next to the subject line. So let's say um, you won't believe this. Maybe this is a bit over the top, but whatever. All right, now click save. And then we can go ahead and design the email. So click on design email. And here we have a couple of different design options you can choose from. Now, um, there are a couple of templates that you can only use when you have upgraded to a paid plan. So this one or this one, you can only use if you're actually a paying customer. Um, but you can pretty much use um, these basic ones right here or also the featured ones, these first two. So I'm gonna choose this first one right here because that really fits um, the content that I wanna um, create an email about. So I'm gonna click on that. And that opens up our email editor that we have seen before with our first welcome email. And so let's just create um, our promotional email right here real quick. Again, I don't wanna spend too much time on creating the email because it's really learning by doing. You can just drag in all the different blocks in right here, then click on the block and then edit everything on the right side. So let's um, delete this right here. I also don't wanna have a logo, so I'm gonna delete this as well. So I'm gonna insert a picture. So I'm gonna click on this pen icon and then I'm gonna click on replace. And I'm gonna upload a new picture. So let's choose, um, let's choose this one because um, this will be about a discount, so a sale. And then we'll just input it right here. You can also change the size of the picture right here. And let's say, let's change this to a check out our crazy discounts today. And then I'm also gonna change the button text to, uh, let's say, save money now. And let's change the color as well. So I'm gonna go to style button, uh, button textile, button style, background. Let's make it green like this. Okay, um, that's good. Then I'm gonna delete this right here. So it's gonna be a very simple email. <laughs> Probably you wanna spend some more time on it again and kind of, kind of uh, put some more content in here to really make them wanna go to your website. 
All right, so once you've finished your email, again, you can always preview it on the top right here and to pre enter preview mode, see how it looks on desktop, see how it looks on mobile. And also you can send yourself a test email by clicking on send a test email, send it to yourself right here and see if everything looks good. And then once you're ready, click on continue on the top right. And then you can again see if everything looks correct right here. Click on, like when you have a paid plan, you can schedule this email as well. So if you wanna have this be sent out um, in uh, like five days, you can click on schedule right here. But when you're a free uh, user, you can only send it immediately. So that's what we're gonna do now. So I'm gonna click on send right here. And right now it will be sent to two subscribers. That's fine. So I'm gonna click on send. All right, perfect. So now the email has been sent out. And after some time, what you can do is you can click on reports right here on the left side and you can check out how many people have opened your emails, how many people have clicked on your email and all that kind of stuff. If you wanna see a more in-depth report, just click on view report right here and then you will see some more information about um, clicks per unique opens, last opened. It's pretty much self-explanatory right here, but this will be really interesting once you have a couple of subscribers and once you have sent out a couple of emails so you can see what really works good, what gives you a high open rate, which email subjects give you a high open rate and what emails don't perform as well. And then you can adjust your email marketing uh, with this information.